वेलकम बैक डियर स्टूडेंट्स टू द फिजिक्स रीजन क्लासेस व्हाट वी नीड टू डू इन दिस क्वेश्चन इज वी नीड टू कैलकुलेट द नॉर्मल वेक्टर ऑफ द पॉइंट दिस ऑन द सरफेस ऑफ एलिप्सॉइड सो दिस इज अ बेसिक क्वेश्चन यू नीड टू अंडरस्टैंड दिस थिंग व्हेन एवर यू नीड टू कैलकुलेट अ वेक्टर परपेंडिकुलर टू सम सरफेस ऑन द सरफेस यू जस्ट नीड टू टेक द ग्रेडिएंट ऑफ दैट सरफेस ओके सो व्हेन वी विल टेक द ग्रेडिएंट ऑफ इट what will we get we will get i cap and then we have integration a derivative of first term that is 2x upon a square with respect to x then we have plus j cap and in derivative with respect to y which gives us this plus k cap derivative with respect to z which gives us this thing okay this is the gradient now substitute the value of the point given point p is this is the given point this is the point p given x is equal to a by root 3 y is equal to b by root 3 z is equal to c by root 3 when we we will substitute this point we will get delta f is equal to i cap and this is 2 by root 3 a notice this point i have cancelled out one a with the a square in the denominator similarly we will be getting j cap and 2 by under root 3 b and then we have k cap and 2 by under root 3 c this is our answer what has been asked in the question is the required thing is delta f this is our answer because they have asked for the normal vectors okay but looking out at the options it seem doesn't seem to be matching with any of the or any one of the option let us calculate its magnitude then okay what will be its magnitude its magnitude will be square of all the terms square sum of the square of all the term that will be giving us 2 by root 3 a whole square plus 2 by root 3 b whole square plus 2 by root 3 of c whole square now you can see that this 2 by root 3 is common in all rest of the term is 1 by a square plus 1 by b square plus 1 by c square okay now let us divide the given vector or the derived vector with its magnitude what will we get you can see that the 2 by under root 3 factor this factor is common in all and this is also common in its magnitude it will be cancelled out okay what we are left out with is i am writing it down here in front of you here we will be getting delta f by f as i cap divided by a plus j cap divided by b plus k cap divided by c the whole term divided by a now i am taking the lcm of the magnitude that will be a square b square c square and this will be giving you b square c square plus a square c square plus a square b square in the numerator of this you can see this the under root of abc a square b square c square is abc and when you will multiply this here you will get bc in the first term ac in the second term and ab in the third term divided by this divided by this okay so option a seems to be matching to the maximum if we will divide it with this with the magnitude of the above vector this will be the absolute answer okay so option a is the correct answer to this question stay tuned with us and thanks for watching